Hello, I'm Dan Galpin for The Developer Show. This is your weekly update on the coolest developer news from Google. We've launched the Rapid Response Virtual Agent Program, a quick way to get up and running with Contact Center AI. Contact Center AI is designed to help government agencies, healthcare and public health organizations, nonprofits, and other COVID-19 impacted industries such as travel, financial services, and retail provide a first line of response through 24-7 conversational self-service support in 23 languages via chat or over the phone. Find out more about how to launch a virtual agent on the post. We released the new Database Inspector in Android Studio 4.1 Canary 5. The Database Inspector allows you to inspect, query, and modify databases in your running app. And if you're using the Room Persistence Library, it helps you run queries to find and at query annotations. Read more about it and all the changes in Android Studio 4.1 Canary 5 on the post. Key Visualizer is now directly integrated into the Bigtable console, giving you more ways to easily monitor your Bigtable performance. Key Visualizer generates visual reports for tables based on the row keys that you access, helpful for iterating on the early designs of a schema before going to production. You can also troubleshoot performance issues, find hotspots, and get a holistic understanding of how you access your Bigtable data. Check out the post to find out more. The new App Brewery Introduction to Flutter development course is now available for free if activated during the next three months. The course covers some of the fundamental concepts for Flutter development, teaching you how to code using Dart and build real-world apps that run on iOS and Android, even if you have no programming experience. Check out the post to find out more and enroll in the course. Chrome 81 is now starting to roll out to stable. Check out the post for info on the WebXR hit test API, allowing you to place virtual objects into your camera's view of the real world. App icon badging graduating from origin trial to stable. A web NFC origin trial allowing web apps to read and write to NFC tags and more. We released the Quantization Aware Training API as part of the TensorFlow Model Optimization Toolkit, enabling you to train and deploy models with the performance and size benefits of quantization while retaining close to their original accuracy. More details and Colab notebooks to get started are on the post. Please remember to like, subscribe, share, and stay safe. I'm Dan Galpin for The Developer Show. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next week.